Hey, welcome back to Living MN Outdoors, and thanks for joining us for Get Living in the Word. Our topic today is Behind the Scenes. We're going to take you back to a story that happened in Exodus chapter 1 and 2. It's the story of baby Moses and how the people who impacted his lives maybe didn't know what they were doing at the time, but it made a huge difference in the lives of the Hebrews and the Egyptians. So, back when baby Moses was born, Pharaoh had ordered a decree that all the baby Hebrew boys were to be killed. But, when Moses was born, the midwives decided to spare his life. At that point, his mom wasn't sure she was going to be able to hide him and keep him safe. So she put him in a basket and floated him in the river. When she did that, Pharaoh's daughter was down at the river bathing and she came across baby Moses and decided to adopt him. At that point, Moses' older sister Miriam approached the Pharaoh's daughter and said that she had a Hebrew mother who could nurse him until he was old enough to eat regular food. So, while this was all taking place, they had no idea what Moses was going to grow up to be. He ended up growing up in Pharaoh's home. He was a high up Egyptian, but he ended up leading the Hebrews out of Egypt in saving his people. But nobody could have ever imagined that back when they took the steps they did to help baby Moses way back in the day. And that just goes to show, guys, that we might not always know what's going behind the scenes at work, at home, what our decisions are impacting other people behind the scenes, but we need to trust that God knows what's going on behind the scenes. Trust that He's a perfect and just God. He knows what's happening and He'll use us any way He sees fit and maybe we'll even impact somebody's life and there'll be another Moses story. You never know. But if you guys get a chance later this week, I would encourage you to read the Moses story. Um, the story of baby Moses is Exodus 1 and 2, but the whole uh, book of Exodus talking about Moses is really good. So if you get the opportunity, read that story. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Please hit that like button, consider hitting the subscribe button, and we'll see you on the next one. And don't forget to get on out there and get living.